Golf mates, welcome down to the channel. Right, if you're new to the channel, welcome. We are the Golf Mates, where we're trying to put fun back in the golf by having a laugh and actually showing you some tips. But on today's video, today's video is something of a challenge we've been doing over the last couple of years. We have got Mr. Barlow, which is a 13 handicapper, and he thinks he's a bit of a player. So the challenge we've got with him is this. We have got Tiger Woods clubs. Now, Tiger Woods, he's famous for a lot of things, women, and stingers so we'll go for mr barlow he's famous for women and stinkers but we're going to speak to him and see what think he can do with the clubs so this is a free old challenge there is a leaderboard so it's a free old challenge and at the top of the leaderboard is myself as plus one and omp as plus one and young man josh i think he was plus three the behind you there is the figure of an athlete Right, Mr. Barlow, yes. I've done some of what I normally don't do, but I've let you hit two spuds in the trees for warm up. Yeah. Now, right, I'm going to be honest, this video is sponsored by James Paul Cosper because he's given us some tailor made golf balls which you cannot get in the UK, and I'm going to let you use them. So we've only got three, yeah. and I don't want you to lose them. I don't want your MBL. Hopefully, I don't. No, show these lovely people Tiger Woods Irons. Very and they can't small. see much there. Very small. Right, show this lovely people these irons. We've got Tiger Woods irons here from our friend from New York, Irish Michael. Or should we call him Irish Mike? Irish Mike. Right. Very nice. Mr. Mike. Barlow. Yes. Do you consider yourself an iron player? Yes. A good one? I wouldn't say a good one, but I have my highs and lows. So I'm, you've got the stinger in you, haven't you? I've got the stinger in me, yeah. And uh, we're going to play three holes. Three holes, yeah. Like First hole else. is 325 yards. Yeah. So what are you going to tee off with? Uh, three iron. Are you? Are you yeah. going to sting it? I'm going to try. Right, golf mates. Three hole challenge. Tiger was irons. Comment below what you think I'm going to score. I think maybe one over, maybe two. I don't know. One over? Yeah. I'm going to go for two over. Don't forget, you're allowed to use your own putter. Oh, yeah. Right, golf mates, I'm going to be honest now. I've left the tripod in the car. I'm handheld hand held here, and I think I'm going to do a good job. I'm going to sneak in, it's going to be okay. Mr. Barlow, the stinker. It's not bad. You happy with that? Yeah, it's not bad. It's got off the tee. Look a bit right. See, I like Mr. Barlow. He's always up for a good challenge and definitely up for a good laugh. He's one of the characters, life characters. But there is no way he's going to par an hole. I'm going to be honest now. The more I think about it, with them clubs, he will not par a hole. Because he's not really warm. And, uh, well, he's not got the finesse as like OMP, has he? Right, Mr. Lark. But Mr. Barlow, you can see a bit of green. Yeah, I found it, yeah. Anything on the green will do me. I think maybe an eight iron. Right, what kind of shot have you got in mind? Uh, ooh, a little cut. A little cut? A little cut round the trees. Right, okay. I don't think you need a cut, That's but... That's the intention, but we'll see. Oh, so you're going for a pin? Uh, well, I, I, anywhere on the green will do me. Right, it's okay. It's a good start. It's a good start. So here's your clubs. They're too small, these, by the way. Oh, right, okay. Get bigger hands. Right, we've got Tiger Woods here, eight iron. Looks like he's training, he's aiming right over the green. Will it cut? Look at this. I don't believe what he's pulled off here. This is disgusting. How's he managed that? That's on the dance floor, isn't it? No, he said the dance floor had gone off. I no, think, I think I'm going to buy some. You don't know where it's gone, you pillock. It's not gone over, has it? He said the green and gone over. It's not. It's massive. What, what a think? golf shot that were. You, hey, I've that, wrong club myself. I tell you what, no, though. It's difficult. But tell me the honest. How did that feel in a blade? Sweet as anything, that one. Absolutely sweet as a nut. Do you know me? I'm always one for take the mick out of you. Yeah. But what a golf shot that were. Yeah, it's felt great. Absolutely great, that one. But have you got Tiger's hands? <laughs> got soft and scoopy hands. So what you're seeing here? The soft. I hope it's not gone over the green. It has. I don't think it has. Right, credit where credit's due, golf mates. Obviously, it was a fantastic golf shot, but his eyes are not working. Obviously, you'll see what pants he's got on. They used to be black, but now they've faded to like a, a weak black colour. That's gone over the green, I think, unless my eyes are gone. But I'm going to be honest, did it come out of the flyer? I don't know. 
but seriously, seriously, that eight iron, and there's a bit of wind, I'd say it's gone 150 and bounced over. So really, what a golf shot. But he's gone now, he's got no short game. His short game's horrendous. In fact, get your kids who have been naughty now to come and watch this short game, because it'll give them nightmares. Just cut it down. Right, I've got you now. So you've only got a pitching wedge. Yeah. What are you going to do? Hopefully just over the bump, if it runs to pin. Over the bunker? There is no over bunker. Bump. Over the bump? All right, I think he's playing another course. Got a chance. I tell you what, got I mean, chance. considering it's a pitching wedge and not got a lob wedge, no. you've got to be happy, right? You're allowed to use your own putter. Honestly, I did not see that coming. That must have been pure fluke. We all know his game, and that is not his game <laughs> at all. Now, let's be honest, looking at the greens now, there have been a little bit of vertical and they have come on great. So there's a bit more pace on the greens, but I'm going to be a greenkeeper for a day again this week. So enjoy the videos coming up next week. Ready? Oh, well, we're ready. Waiting for you. Hey. Mm. How did that not go? It's gone behind the hole. I tell you what. You were waiting and waiting, but what a putt that were. Oh, what one over. One over. If it was safe to say, we'll give you that, Steve. You don't have to put your hand in it, finger. Take that away. Thank you. Now, let's be honest. Great trip. Great chip. Yeah. Fantastic iron shot. Yeah. Beautiful putt. Yeah. And you got a bogey. Yeah. Anything to say to the gods up there? Uh, give me a bit of good luck. These, we talk, we've just had a comment about these pants. Did they used to be black before you've washed them that many times? They've gone like a silver black. Well, it looks a bit showy, so there's no point putting the good stuff on, is there? I mean, that t-shirt's old as well, isn't it? It's lasted, don't it? Yeah, that, we like that, we like so that. So it's one over. Now, I have given him a bit of abuse, sir, on that hole, but he's hit a beautiful iron, beautiful putt, and a beautiful chip. I'll still give him some more abuse on the next hole, because that's what we do around here. Like I said, if you're enjoying this video, and what I'm going to do, we're going to do something different. If you can get a fellow golf mate to subscribe and be a golf mate and you put his name underneath the comments with yours, you'll go into a draw and we'll invite you up, both of you, to do the challenge here at Charlton Comardy. So obviously if you're coming from the States, we do apologise, you're probably not going to fly over here just to play three holes. But if you're in the UK, it's there. Uh, so if you want to go in the draw and it's a proper draw and then you thought you could have a doubles match against me and Steve, yeah. So if you get one of your mates to subscribe, but put his name down, who subscribed, and let him comment as well. But you're going to draw, and you can come and do the free old challenge with Tiger Woods Clubs, and have a match with me and Steve for a fiver. Par three. This is going to be problems. What are you going with? Six iron. Six iron? You've just hit an eight iron, 150 odd. I know, it's strong wind, isn't it? Oh, well, yep, yeah, okay. Anywhere on the green. Oh, the that's why you map. Anywhere on the green. It's a back pin. It's playing about one... I think you've got too much club, mate. I think it's seven iron all day, and I'm a caddy on the European Tour, remember? Top eight. Don't let me swear you. You know if it's short now, I am in the poo-poo. He's going to give it all that laddie down, but six iron's too much. I'm positive. Because he's a player, innit? He's a player. I had a seven iron at first. You are? I had a seven iron at first, but I'm Jim. Right. Wind's dropped. He's got the right club if he hits a good one. I don't believe what I've just seen. That's a big shot now. Was well, it landed that? Left at pin. Is it on the green? No, it's just off. What a golf shot! These are even further than my own. I think you. I, I'm not being. They're better than your own. Are you seeing a swap here? Links for tigers. Well, if you're good enough for tiger, they're not good enough for me, aren't they? <laughs> Honestly, I don't know if I've got that in the zoom. But that started off on the pin and had a little draw and the wind is a little bit that way. But I think it's pin eye again. Oh, I've mentioned her again, Ken. Oh my God. Yes. So comment below, get your golf mate. So subscribe to be a golf mate, but comment who you've got and he comments. Honestly, you're in a draw, you come and play the free old challenge, right? And then you'll have a match with me and Mr. Barlow. Or we'll chuck the balls up because I don't want to be playing with him. Right, here we are. So we got lucky. Pitch mark. Right, you. 
pitch in. Can I be honest? And it's gonna break my heart what I'm gonna say. Yeah. That was the best iron shot you played this season since the back. And not even your clubs. No. What are you hitting with? Pitching. Oh my what kind of are you hooding it like you know do, are you? Closing and just running it in. So you go, he's closing the pitching wedge. <laughs> Everyone laughs at it, it's effective. <laughs> it's a bit harder. Well, he's got his self, it's not bad. I mean I'm calling him. And no doubt you were laughing with me and you were calling him. Ooh, oh no, he's got a lot of work there, uh, a lot of work. Alright. Hard put. Not bad. Don't touch the pin, you're not allowed. With your hands, you daft sod. Cleaning Saying that, looks like the world's getting back to normal. From tomorrow, we're filming this on... Well, you're going to see this today when we're filming it. From tomorrow, it's only a metre apart and you can go to people's houses, I believe. Can I take that pin out? No, you can't touch it yet. If it hits a pin, we'll class it as right. in. I'll give you a bit of leeway. I'll go to the side. It's leaning forward. Yeah, I'll go to the side so they can see it. If it hits it, full on, you can have the shot. Mr. Barlow, soft hand scoopy whoopy, chicken and run, shrug me Jesus for a pal. Mr. Barlow, yes. to be fair, great chip, great shot, yes. and the putt were alright, it was just sometimes a drop, sometimes a don't. That's it. To all the par. I know. 18th hole. Yes, coming up. I tell you what. Not an easy tee shot, is it, with irons? No. But if you bogey this, I think Josh has done you. Yeah, we'll see. See what happens, eh? Mr. Barlow. Yes. Two over gross. I know, no luck. You've not done it wrong, really, have you? No, I've just been unfairly punished, let's say. Yes. Do you have no luck? Have you got lo luck in love life, haven't you? Yeah, at the moment. Come on, what are you hitting? Three iron. Three iron through that gap? Yeah. Oh my, chicken and rice. I don't think I'm going to be able to zoom it right. It's going to go left. Oh yeah, I'm not, you're going to see it's faded left to right, it'll be okay, but, yeah. Uh, did you play for the fade? Well anyway, just charge it off left, hopefully it was straight, but it's just uh, faded a little bit. You can see why Tiger Woods got rid of them, don't you? I think they're alright. Best iron strikes I've seen you yet, ever. So his free iron there, left to right, very similar to his first one he did, on the first hole. But the other irons... It's hard to say, I think he's hitting better than me in OMP. He really has flushed them. <sighs> I wonder how many comments I've got, plus two, plus three. Will he par this? He should do, he should do. He's probably only got about 100 yards in, max. Not even that. How close are you going out of bounds there? I didn't think it was that bad. It's a nice road, isn't it? Bouncing still. Tell you what. It's a bit nice. You've always got to mention her. It doesn't matter what it is. Have oh, you? Yeah. You just got to mention her. You can't stop. So, if you're new to the channel, Mr. Barlow's got a girlfriend called Pin Eye. Yes. There's rumours she's called Ken. Is that true or not? No, Ked. K E D, not K E N. Ked. Are you saying we've fabricated, fabricated the truth? Yes. Or whatever you call it. Yes, you have. She's called Ked. English name. Or Ked, not Ken. No, Ked. We'll stick to. K E D. To, well, well, Pin Eye's better. Right. So this is what he's got. Little bit of tree and way. Can I just come this side? Yeah. But, but don't shank it. Right, well, have you got a wedge or something? Pitching. Right. Mr. Barlow, second shot, 18th. Tiger Woods' his clubs. What a golf shot. Like I wonder where that's gone. That's on the green. Uh, pin high. I mean, sorry, in line with the pin. <laughs> What are you saying about them clubs? I think they're alright. I think we should go somewhere else. With, I'm going to call it. I think you're hitting them better than yours. Listen, by the three iron, I think you should forget that. Five iron onwards, you should it's say. It's not an easy iron to hit, is it? But I think, next time we get a chance, you should play in a competition with them irons. Yeah, I'm up for that. Would you have a bit of that? What about my wedges, though? Can I play with you the wedges? You can have your own wedges, your own woods. I, I think three iron, don't take it. It's too yeah. hard hit. I think down. five iron to wedge, take them out. Yeah, all right, I'll do that if you want. Yeah? See how we get on. Look at you, fine figure of man. Pin eye must be ecstatic with you. Well, it keeps getting in, pin eye, and I'm going to be honest. What a golf shot. What a fantastic shot. Oh. 
Oh, it is. It is Pinai. Here, watch this. We're coming up. We're coming up. We're coming up. There you go. I tell you what. Right, you know me. I like to give you. Yeah. But what a great golf shot that were. Some good irons, but not good. So, uh, do you reckon you play better in your score? I think I have, yeah, to be honest. What do you mean, to be honest? Does that mean you normally well, lie towards? I listened to you of one, one iron, I went through the green. What, eight iron? Yeah, that should never gone through green, should it? Well, it'll come out a bit of a flyer, maybe. Well, maybe. Check we'll find out. out with the replay, we'll see where it landed. Right. Wow. I'm going to try and do a low down shot. Don't ask me why I'm doing this. I have no absolute... There you go. You can see the putt here proper. For a birdie. I think he deserves one. Let's give it a whack. Oh, it's hit summer. Tapping par. So, plus two. Yeah. Right, golf mates. Uh, that's the end of the challenge. Two over. A I don't think I've played that bad, to be honest. No, I'm, I'm going to agree with you. I think you've hit some beautiful yeah. shots and it's hurt me to say it. Don't forget to like, comment. And what about you, golf mates? Nominate who you think should do the next challenge. Yeah, hey, that's a good one. In the comment, yeah. who they should... Right, I've done it. OMP's done it. Yeah, Josh has done it. And that's it? So Dave the Pro's not done it. eBay, everybody. Has Chubby done it? No. Chubby's not done it, yeah. So they should comment, shouldn't they? Who, yeah, who they want to who see they it? who they want to see to do it. Right. right, golf mates, thank you very much for the pre-orders up to now for the polos. It's much appreciated. Link is in the description and it's quickly flashed up there now. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much for your support. It really means a lot that you're supporting the channel and you're getting a great t-shirt for it. Hopefully I should get all mine early next week and all the lads so you'll see them in flesh. All the polo shirts are on pre-order now, delivered to your home anywhere you live in the world. Free of charge. Free of charge. Right, so it's a goodbye from me. Goodbye from me. And we'll see you tomorrow. Take care.